Chapter 6 In the year King Uzziah died, I saw the Lord. He was sitting on a lofty throne, and the train of his robe filled the temple. Hovering around him were mighty seraphim, each with six wings. With two wings they covered their faces, with two they covered their feet, and with the remaining two they flew. In a great chorus they sang, Holy, holy, holy is the Lord Almighty, the whole earth is filled with his glory. The glorious singing shook the temple to its foundations, and the entire sanctuary was filled with smoke. Then I said, My destruction is sealed, for I am a sinful man and a member of a sinful race. Yet I have seen the King, the Lord Almighty. Then one of the seraphim flew over to the altar, and he picked up a burning coal with a pair of tongs. He touched my lips with it and said, See, this coal has touched your lips. Now your guilt is removed, and your sins are forgiven. Then I heard the Lord asking, Whom should I send as a messenger to my people? Who will go for us? And I said, Lord, I'll go, send me. And he said, Yes, go. But tell my people this, You will hear my words, but you will not understand. You will see what I do, but you will not perceive its meaning. Harden the hearts of these people, close their ears, and shut their eyes. That way they will not see with their eyes, hear with their ears, understand with their hearts, and turn to me for healing. Then I said, Lord, how long must I do this? And he replied, Until their cities are destroyed, with no one left in them, until their houses are deserted, and the whole country is an utter wasteland. Do not stop until the Lord has sent everyone away to distant lands, and the entire land of Israel lies deserted. Even if only a tenth, a remnant, survive, it will be invaded again and burned. Israel will remain a stump, like a tree that is cut down, but the stump will be a holy seed that will grow again.